Okay, we're gonna take some shredded hash browns, put them in a bowl, one can of cream of chicken soup. We're making pepper jack potato casserole today. Sounds like a good recipe. Two cups of pepper jack cheese that I've shredded ahead of time. One and a half cups of heavy whipping cream. One stick of melted butter. I didn't say it was low fat, but. Half a cup of sour cream. One fourth cup Parmesan cheese. We're gonna mix this all together and then we're gonna season it. Okay, now we're going to add in a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. and one teaspoon of onion powder. If you don't like that, you don't have to though. Some salt. And some pepper. Kim, what's your favorite kind of seasoning? Um, You know, I don't really, salt and pepper, I don't, I don't do big in seasoning myself. I know Charles is big in the Creole seasoning. Oh yeah, no. I have, um, I can't do much hot or spicy stuff, that's for sure. Now we're gonna take this and put it in a greased nine by 13. Plop it all in here. Spread this out. It should be. I would. I believe this is going to be a good potato casserole. We will definitely tell you. Now something like this, I can handle the pepper jack cheese. You but that's because. Yeah, that's because it's cheese. I'll eat anything with cheese. Okay. <clears throat> then you're going to take one sleeve of Ritz crackers, crushed, and we're going to add a half a cup of cooked bacon. And then you're gonna take some Parmesan cheese and add about a half a cup. They say three fourths, but we're gonna do about a half a cup. And then you're gonna mix these together. You may just wanna take your hands and kind of toss it. Probably get a bigger bowl. I didn't get a big enough bowl of it but that's okay. Y'all like my apron I wore it today for Mr. Billy Hood? He said I need the apron, so I put on the apron this morning. Well, it looks great on you, Kim. Thank you. Now you're going to take your topping and you're going to sprinkle it all over the top. You know, that topping looks really good. But to me, you can't go wrong with Ritz crackers either. And we are going to bake this at 400 for about 45 minutes, and then we'll check it. Oh, that looks so good. Good job, Okay. Got our pepper jack potato casserole. Don't that look good? So good. Okay. Now we'll taste test it. That is bacon bits. Mm. Okay. Cooked bacon. So is this this is gluten free then? No, it's not. It's not gluten free. Ooh, look at that. Why isn't it now gluten free? I'm Ritz not crackers sure. on top? Yes. 
All right, y'all, let's try this thing. It's looking pretty nice, if I do say so myself. Mm. That's good. That's really good. Mm. 